If you've gotten rejected from a club, activity, or organization, or job, congratulations. Rejection is the first step. For most people, this is how I've been able to build my life. I am great at rejection. I get curious when I get rejected. I don't take it personally, maybe just a little bit at first, but then I get really curious because rejection is an opportunity for you to build relationships with the people doing the things you want to do. The example of, let's say, an acapella group. Someone messaged me that they didn't get into the acapella group. They, they really love singing. And my answer is talk to the people who run that organization Thank them for the opportunity to audition. Ask them what you can do over the next year. You might discover there were more seniors than ever, more juniors, or maybe another group merged with another group. Whatever it is, you'll you'll get information, and then you can decide. Maybe I want to. Maybe you want to start your own acapella group because if a lot of people didn't get in, there's probably a lot of people who want to sing. Maybe it could be like a first year acapella group, and everybody gets to sing. Or or you can ask if you can help with the organization. Maybe do advertising, bring equipment. Do something where you can still participate, not as someone who's singing, but as someone who's supporting the group. And then eventually someone gets sick, someone doesn't show up. And if you're there and they know who you are, then you can have an opportunity. This is how I became a columnist, the Indiana Daily student. I was writing these editorials and a columnist didn't show up. And the editor, uh, Tony Jewell, was sitting across the desk and he goes, hey, Cone, do you write columns? And I go, sure. And in my head, I'm like, now I do. But it was because I was doing something and I was in a place surrounded by people. And that really is what launched my, my writing career. So if you get rejected, get curious. Get curious. Don't take it personally. Get curious. Figure out if there's anything you can do to change the outcome. Meet the people who are doing the things you want to do. This is a long game, and especially if you're a first-year student, there are so many schools where it's so hard to get access to these groups. So while you're trying to get into those groups, make sure you have one or two places where you are accepted and included simply because you exist. Simply because you exist while building those meaningful connections, understanding it's a long game, and practice getting great at rejection.